Hey, good morning, guys. I hope everybody's doing okay this morning. I'm going to bring you a haul of things I went and got so I could work on the china cabinet. So we're going to go through that and then we're going to start decorating. So we're going to jump right into it. I think I'm going to do uh, Hobby Lobby first. I went to several places yesterday. Whenever I go out, I try to hit as much as I can because I try to be at work by noon. So, whenever, whenever I leave here, the house, I leave here about 8.45 because stores don't open until 9. So, when I get there at 9, I'm, I'm just running and hitting to see what new stuff is out there. Um, you're going to have to excuse me today. I've got a sinus infection or allergy, something. I don't know what the deal is. But um, me and my husband seem to keep passing it back and forth to each other. <clears throat> So the first thing I got was this. I thought it was really cute. Um, it's got the buffalo check and they had them for 50 off and it was only $4.99. So I thought it would really be cute to put in something I don't know yet. Um, whenever I go shopping, I really don't have much in my head on where everything is going to go. I just go and I look for something that, that I like. And when I get home, then I try to find places for it. I know you probably shouldn't shop like that because that's kind of like impulse buying, but I'm sorry, that's what I do. Uh, the next thing I got was this runner. I found it and I thought it was really cute. I thought I would do it once the Easter stuff came down, either to put on that locker where the blooming lamps are or put in the dining room, I don't know. But I thought it was really cute. It says eat on the back of it. Um, it was regular $11.99, 50% off. I really liked it. I was kind of excited about that. Um, the next thing I got, I got a couple of these vinyl decals. Um, I'm gonna put them in the office over those bookshelves. And, uh, I've done these before at our children's church whenever we were redoing it, remodeling, and they turned out really cute. These I found, and they were 50 off yesterday. This one was regular $19.99, and it says, Life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass. It's learning to dance in the rain. So I thought that was real cute. But I think I'm going to put that above one of the uh, bookshelves. And then I've got this other one to put over there on the other side. It says, be your own kind of beautiful. So we'll see how that goes. This one was $24.99 and it was half off of it as well. Um, the next thing I got were these, they're uh, napkin rings, but I thought they were really cute. Uh, they were in the spring section for $2.99 a piece. And so they were 40% off. But I thought they'd be really cute just to sit in the china cabinet just to add a splash of color. I've got some other ones I had bought before that are already sitting in there waiting on us. <clears throat> but I got three more. Uh, the next thing I got was a couple of stencils. I, I like to do wood, wood burning and I've never done it with y'all. And I've got a gift that I'm going to do um, pretty soon. And I'm going to do some wood burning on the wooden, uh, you know, like the wooden spoons. I'm going to do some wood burning on it. So I'm going to show you how I do that. They're really a cute, inexpensive gift if you've never done it. It's kind of fun. Uh, so we may do that maybe one day next week. <clears throat> But this I thought was cute. I didn't know if I wanted to do this on something for wood burning or if I wanted to paint it. But I thought it was really cute, these little decals. They were $2.99. But I thought that could go on a lot of things, uh, farmhouse style, if you wanted to put it on a pillow or a milk jug or just whatever. I thought it'd be kind of cute like on a cutting board and do wood burning. Whenever I do the wood burning, I like to just get a stencil and I'll outline it onto whatever the wood product is I'm doing. 
That way I've already got a line and I'm just drawing it with that wood burning tool. But I got that. And then I got this stencil. And I thought it was real cute. I don't know if you could see that, the glare that's on it. Uh, let me turn this. See, it makes it real dark. But do you see the that stencil that's on there? And you could put different names. I thought that would be really cute on one of those uh, spoons. But see, it's got that and it's got all the letters. This was $6.99, but I used my 40% off for that. And then I just got some, some glue, no big deal. Uh, it was $4.99, it wasn't on sale. But, uh, and then I got a couple of these little wooden blocks. I've got another project coming up that I'm gonna do and I got these. I didn't know what size I wanted, so I just got both of them. These was a two-pack for $2.99, and this one was $1.99. They also had their greenery and their flowers half off, so I got this one to probably lay in that china cabinet just to add some color. It was $14.99 and it was half off. And then I just got some, just a whole bunch of these little picks. And these were $5.99 and 50% off. I got a bookshelf and it's, I've got it leaning up in the, uh, in the office already. I'll go get it in a minute and show you uh, what I'm gonna put that at. It's really cute, I was waiting on it to go on sale and it was on sale this week. Uh, let me turn this light back on so you can see better. Hello. Um, next, I went to Ross, but I only grabbed one thing that was all I seen. Um, and it was just some wooden spoons so I could do the burning on it. I like to have extra ones so I can doodle and play around. I haven't done much of this since we've been in this house because it's been so haywire around here trying to get settled in. Um, so I like to do a lot of little small crafts. I don't do <clears throat> the really long projects. So I'll start doing some crafts with you from time to time because you can only decorate so much in a house until the next season comes. So um, I'll be filling in from time to time doing little crafts like this. These spoons were $3.99 at Ross. So, I mean, I just got the cheap ones. I don't want to spend a bunch of money on the on the ones that are more expensive and then I screw up on them. So, these, there's three, there's seven of them in this package. So, I've got plenty to play with. <clears throat> and then I went to TJ Maxx next. Let me move it over here. Scoot everything down. <clears throat> I got this little bunny. I thought he was so cute. He's got little fur on him. But I was going to set him in the china cabinet. And his little ears, it's got wire in it. So I can make them do whatever I want them to do. Make them kink up or whatever. This little guy was $7.99. I say little guy, little girl. It's not a guy. But she's really cute. <clears throat> and then I found some more Ray Dunn. And you know me, I've started collecting this Ray Dunn and now it's addicting. I go to every store and I'm looking. So I found these mixing bowls and it says snack, bites, and treats. There's three of them in here. <clears throat> and they were $24.99. But they're plastic, they're not glass, and I like that. But I think I'm going to stack them under my mixer. I don't know if you can... I have a mixer that's over here. I think I'm going to take that bowl out. And for a while, you know, while it's just sitting out and I'm not using it, I thought about stacking these bowls in there. I thought that would be really cute. That way it would kind of pull the Ray Dunn that I have in here. And then I got this tray farm fresh milk. I thought it was really cute. I got it the other day whenever me and my oldest boy went out shopping. 
Um, it was $14.99. But I think I'm gonna put it on top of the uh, china cabinet. Probably not today, I don't feel like climbing up there. But I think I'm gonna set it up there and I think that'll be cute. Um, that's all I have in here. I'm gonna move us to the dining room. That's where the rest of my stuff is and we'll do the rest of the hall in there. So hold on just a second. Okay guys, I'm in the dining room now. I've got the rest of the stuff that I have bought um, in my hall. So I'll show you and then I've got some other stuff already laying here of what I thought I might want in that china cabinet. So I don't know if I'll use everything but I've got it here just in case we need it. I've also moved I don't know if you can see in the china cabinet I've already kind of got it set up we're not doing the bottom part we're just going to do the top part so I've put some of my plates in there just for some color I didn't have any other colored plates and I may still buy some and put some in there I don't know so we're just going to wing this because I haven't done any planning on what I'm going to do in there uh so you're going to see me put it up and take it down. But that's me and that's what I do. And I think any anybody else that's doing decorating in their home, that's probably what they do too. And you keep moving stuff around until you get it the way you like it. So first of all, what I've got in here is I went to Pier 1 yesterday. And I looked and looked. They had all their Easter stuff 25% off. But I couldn't find anything that I wanted from there. I've already bought a lot of their stuff for Easter. So I didn't want to repeat what uh, some of the other things I had. But I did find a canister set that I fell in love with. And it was 25% off too. And I'm going to set it in that cabinet. Um, not sure yet how it's going to go. But uh, I'm going to show you these. They are absolutely adorable. Isn't that so cute? This is the big one. There's three of them. There's a small, medium, and a large. This was regular $29.99, but I got it 25% off. Um, and then here's the medium. It was regular $24.99. And then the small one was $19.99. But when she rang them up, they rang up really good. I mean, it was like one was 12, one was 14, I think, and the other one was 18, something like that. So um, it rang up really good price for me. So I was really happy with that. Um, the next thing, if you haven't noticed, I say um a lot. I try to quit saying it, but I can't. It's just a... I don't know if it's just a Texas thing or if it's my thing, but it's a habit. So I'm sorry for all the ums. TJ Maxx, I had bought, it was a set of four, I believe, little cupcake stands. They're pale pink. Uh, they were $7.99. I think, yeah, there was four of them in here, but I, I'm not going to use them for a cupcake stand. I thought it would be good to kind of give a little bit of height. Um, I bought some little bowls that I'm going to put these in to stack because there's three of them. Uh, these little bowls right here, there's three of them. You see the little bunny on it. Aren't they cute? I don't know how much they were. I already took the tag off. I think it was $9.99. This was the smallest one. Isn't that cute? And then there was a medium and then the large. But it came as a three pack. So I thought it was a pretty good deal that it was $9.99 for all three of them. And I've already tried this out. It's the reason why I've opened that box. I'm going to set this cupcake stand in here. And then put the medium. And it sits on it pretty good. And then grab another one. And put it in there. And put that one. So then it kind of stacks up for us. But I thought that'd be real cute sitting in there. Probably could stack a little higher, but um, I don't have anything that I can find that will do it a little higher than that. Then I went and grabbed this garden ball out of the closet. 
Got it at Hobby Lobby. It was $6.99. Use that. This I got at TJ Maxx. It was $12.99. It goes with these bowls. But I thought I would just sit that in there. So I thought that was cute. And the next thing I got, I'm doing a lot of stretching here because I've got it scattered all over the place. I got this picture at TJ Maxx. I thought it was real cute. I took the tag off of it too already. So I don't know how much it was. I think it was $6.99 or something like that. It wasn't too much. But isn't it cute? It says, somebody, somebody loves you. I pulled it from another table. I got it at Hobby Lobby. I'm going to set it in there. It was $7.99 on their spring. But I thought it was real cute. So I thought it would add some color. And then a plate holder. I'm going to show you now. I told you I had gotten some Ray Dunn off of the marketplace on Facebook the other day. And it was just meant to be because whenever um, I had first opened the marketplace, it was there. It was the very first thing I seen and I was so excited. So, um, and the lady somehow lived in the same town as I did. So that was, that was great. So I'm going to show you what a little bit of Easter Ray done and I'm going to put it in this cabinet. Now I know it's got some pink on it and it really doesn't match with what's on the table, but you know what? I don't care. Um, I like it and that's what I'm going to put in there. So let me grab it. Got that. That was the first one. It was the tall one. Isn't it cute? It says bunny love on it. It's got the little pink lid. But I thought that was real cute. Uh, it says hop on and it's pink inside. And then this one says happy Easter. I'm sorry, this light is putting a glare. It says Happy Easter and it's pink inside as well. And then I got a couple of other ones. Got this one. Let me turn this light off again. Ugh. Okay. See that? Isn't that cute? It says Happy Easter on the flags. It's kind of dimply. It's different. You can probably see that. Uh, it's different than the ones that these other two. But it's got a white lid. The lady told me she thought this this piece was a little older than those other ones. And then the small one says hip hop. And it's got the pink lid. Isn't that cute? I'm not going to go way overboard on the Ray Dunn, so don't be alarmed by that. I just wanted these Easter pieces, and I've seen a whole bunch more Ray done, but they were pieces that I didn't think that I would use, so um, I haven't, I didn't get them. I just wanted these little pieces just to put in my cabinet, and I may buy some more here and there, I don't know, but um, I had been seeing these Ray done. I'm on Pinterest a lot. And I, I love Pinterest for the ones that haven't been on it. It gives me a lot of ideas, a lot of inspiration. Whenever I'm trying to think of something to do, a craft to do, I'll just put it in Pinterest and it'll bring up things that gives me ideas. So um, if you haven't ever been on Pinterest, check it out. You might like it. The next thing I've got over here, uh, this was a piece. That was on my wedding cake uh, 10 years ago. And I have set it in my china cabinet from day one, from when we had a china cabinet. But I just, I just like it. And it just reminds me every time I see it of our wedding. So it, it always has a special place in the cabinet and I always put it in there somewhere, somehow. The next thing I grabbed, I just had a couple of these little vases and they were, you know, the pastel colors for Easter. I think I might turn them upside down or leave them this way just to add some height if I need it. Uh, these aren't anything special actually. They came from edible arrangements, <laughs> but I thought they were really cute little vases. I had bought this a while back. 
This came from TJ Maxx and it was $6.99. But I thought I might could use that. And then I got whew, this little Easter bunny. I got him a couple of weeks ago. I got him at Kirkland's. He was $5.99. So I thought I might could set him in there. Who knows? So um, I think we're fixing to get started. So let's decorate. Okay, I don't know if I've got the angle right on this. So um, I've got this big table right here. So I can't get the camera up the way that I'd like to. I may end up having to put it on the other side of the table, but we'll see. Um, so this is what I've gotten in here so far. These are just my, my plates. I got these from uh, Birch Lane, if anybody has ever heard of that company. I don't know if you can see the ribbed on it, but they are really pretty plates. But I got these uh, for whenever we have special occasions. These are my nicer plates to eat off of. So I grabbed a couple of these just to lay back there. If I can find some colored plates, and I know I can, I can probably just go to the dollar store and get some. But just to add them back there for now, that's I'm just leaning them back there. This piece right here was my grandmother's, and it's an egg, you know, to do deviled eggs with. It's really pretty. It's really old. So I set that in there. And I may end up moving it before it's over with. Who knows? <clears throat> But <clears throat> I have this whisk, whisk, whisker, this wicker basket, you know, it's uh, to put your silverware and stuff in. I just got it. I've had it for a long time, but I got it just to fill a hole. And so I had it, I've been kind of playing around a little bit with it. I'm going to set it in this corner and I may get some napkins. I don't know and put in there. But we'll see. Uh, uh, what do I want to do? I think we'll start with this picture. Um, like I said, I may put this stuff up here and then take it down and put it up and take it down. So I'm not sure really. We'll try it right there. I don't know if I want to keep the canisters together or if I want to separate them. Um, I'm not sure how much stuff I've got to go in here. I'm hoping I have enough. I'm going to separate them for now and see how I like that. Uh, we'll put, the, put that one on that side. I'll do with the small one. The small one right here. Make our plate more in the center. Where do I want this? Where's my tag? What's up this? Let's see what else I got. Bunny side out. It's real cute. I think I'm going to put the Ray Dunn stuff here. Let's see here. Hmm. I could put the Easter bunnies over here together, maybe. Like that. And maybe put this here. Oh, I've tried to adjust the camera a little bit. I'm fixing to set the Ray Dunn stuff here. I've put the rabbit bowls up here for now. Um, I don't know if you can see the other side. 
but I've put the camera, I mean the camera, wow. I've put the pitcher and I've put the smaller canister right here with the bigger one up there. And then I just put that plate there. So I'm gonna set the Rave Done stuff here. Of these cupcake okay, stands and I'm going to set the coffee cups coffee cups there on those I've got to set it back far enough where this door will shut I went and got some of my green picks. I'm not really sure where I'm going to put it. I'm thinking of putting it right here. These greenery picks, this one and this one, these are both my favorite ones to use because they're so fluffy and they're real easy to stick in things. Uh, and they're the cheapest too. These were, but this one is $6.99 and it's half off and this one's $5.99 and it's half off. So. I have bought a lot of these because you can just stick them just about anywhere. And it it adds some color. I think I'm gonna set this one right here and maybe put my egg in it. It needed something right there. Okay, so I'm gonna give you a close up of what each shelf looks like. There's the biggest canister there. And then the plate. And the little bunny. I thought he was cute. She was cute. I've got that plate in the back. You know, I really could even take them out. I don't even need them back there. Unless I find me some pastels. I may go to the dollar store today and see if they've got some kind of plastic pastel plates. I don't want to spend a bunch of money on them. But uh, this is the bottom shelf. I'm sorry I'd back up, but this table is here. So I'm having to get everything really close. That was the small canister that was there. And then over here, it turned out really cute. And then the top, that was the medium canister on the end over there. Okay, I'm on the other side of the dining room table now, so maybe you can see, uh, see how it turned out. I got really cute. I'm happy with it. And I didn't have to do very much switching around. Kind of already had a plan. I just hadn't stuck it in there yet. But yeah, those plates I'm going to have to replace that are in the back and put some color. Maybe some pink or green ones or 
one of both, I don't know. But that was the bottom that we had already decorated. Okay, well, there was one more piece I told you I had gotten from my haul, and it was a shelf to go underneath this in the office. Um, I've got it leaned up against here, but it's a huge shelf, but it's going to go right there somewhere. I don't know where at actually, but about right there. But it's a pretty wide shelf, so I'll be able to put whatever I want to on it. Uh, the price was $64.99, and it was half off yesterday. You know, they have smaller ones, but I really like the rustic look of it, and I think it'll go in here real well. Well, if I can get to sit down. And then I'll put those... Oh, I'm sorry, I'm having a horrible day. Um... I'm going to put the red, those decals, if you can see, above me right there. I'm going to put one of them right there over that. And then I want to put the other one over there, over there. So, that is my plan. I don't know if I'm going to run video showing that or not showing you how to do that it's pretty self-explanatory oh uh, now there's something shining on my head i'm telling you what my sweet husband he just called to check on me he said he was worried about me uh probably because we keep passing it back and forth to each other but um i hope y'all have a great day this is hump day so we're halfway through the week it's, I think the high today is the low 70s. The sun's already shining, so that's always a positive. Um, we will be heading to church tonight, so it's going to be a busy day. I got to get this uploaded and put out for y'all and then get to work and then get to church and hopefully start feeling better in the middle of all this. So I want y'all to have an awesome day, and I will see y'all Friday. Bye.